My name is Miriam Skeen. I'm Glenn Barras. And we're the people to see at your young age if you feel like giving up smoking for your son. It's a voice of they feel it. Yes. We're the people to see. We're the people to see at your young age if you feel like giving up smoking for yourself and live a healthy lifestyle. Our job is tackling indigenous smoking in the whole street region, including Balgo, Mullen, Ringasog and Villa Luna. Smoking causes cancer and it's bad for you, your family and unborn babies. A lot of young people like to play sports, but to do that, and be good at it, you need to be healthy and have good lungs to give your body oxygen and make you run faster without being short of breath. Pregnant mothers who smoke are also doing damage to their unborn babies because the nicotine drugs goes into your bloodstream and into the womb where the baby is growing. They also get addicted to smoking. Please think about them as well. Nicotine is the drug that's in the cigarette and causes you to be dependent on it. Most people say they can't stop smoking because it helps them relax when they're feeling stressed out. You can stop. It's your brain that's saying you need another nicotine hit to feel good. Come to Uriyangi and see us. We can offer you counselling and the doctor can put you on one of these nicotine factors. Nicobite chewing gums yeah. or Champix tablets to help you with the cravings and stop smoking. Thank you guys for coming and listening to us. Remember that smoking is bad for you. Keep it up. And just watch our little video on it. You know what kills more Aboriginal people than anything else? Is it? Violence, drugs, alcohol, car accidents. It's smoking cigarettes. Smoking kills more Aboriginal people than any other drugs and alcohol combined. Then why do nearly half of Indigenous Australians over 15 smoke? Some people think smoking makes you look cool or more grown up. Well, this is what can happen to smokers. Still think it looks cool? If you smoke a pack a day, that's about $6,000 a year. Think about what else you can buy with that money. But more importantly, smoking can take your life. At this cost, who can afford to smoke? So what do they put in a cigarette? They use leaves from the tobacco plant that have a very strong chemical in them called nicotine. Nicotine is addictive and makes you want more and more and more. But that's not all. Then they add more than 200 poisons, including insect spray, toilet cleaner, lighter fluid, arsenic and rocket fuel and even that's not all in fact there are more than 4,000 chemicals that go into one cigarette so how does smoking kill when you smoke all those chemicals go through your mouth into your lungs and get into your blood then the blood carries them to your brain and it makes you feel good and you want more and more. But the blood also carries the chemicals all around the body and small lumps called tumours can start to grow inside you. The tumours can spread around your body and start killing you. These tumours are called cancer. Many smokers die from cancer. Smoking makes your heart get weaker. It can't pump the blood around your body properly. Many smokers die because they get heart disease or have a heart attack. 
the lungs also get weak and this makes it hard to breathe. Then you can't play sport so well. Smoking can also make it easier to get diabetes and other serious health problems. The worst thing is these things can happen to people who don't even smoke. People get sick just from being around smokers. This is called passive smoking. One in every four people who die from cigarette smoke don't even smoke. Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders die earlier than non-Indigenous Australians. They also smoke twice as much. When pregnant women smoke, it hurts the baby. The chemicals from the smoke go through the mother's body and into the baby's body. The baby can be born too early and it can get sick all the time. Too much smoking while pregnant can even kill the baby. 20% of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people will die from illnesses caused by smoking. That's one person in every five. Will it be you? Your mum, dad, brother, sister, son or daughter? Smoking is killing too many people, but it can be stopped. Keep culture and family alive. Quit today. Thank you everyone for listening and watching the video.